hello guys welcome back to my channel so good to have you here again in this tutorial we're going to be making a simple flay dress with a printed neck design so sit back and enjoy this very simple tutorial and if you enjoyed this video please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so so let's get right on to it so i'm going to be using the back to cut the front so i'll be marking the back first and as you can see i'm folding my one and a half inch allowance for zip allowance before i start taking my actual measurements and so the i'm going to be taking my armhole my armhole measurement is eight inches and then my half length is also the same as my waist length it's 16 inches plus one inch allowance that will be 17. so first we take our shoulder measurement shoulder measurement is 14 divided into two plus one inch allowance then the bust measurement you divide your bust measurement into four and then you add your allowance mine is 40 divided into four is 10 and i'm using three inches allowance so you also do the same with the waist you divide your waist measurement by four and add your allowance and then you want to connect this and then you cut it out so after cutting the back next we are going to do is to take the back and place it on top of the fabric we used to cut the front and remember that we are going to do a printed neck so we are going to leave about two inches allowance for the printing of the neck so we cut it out now so for my shoulder slope i'm going to be taking three inches from my neck my shoulder slope and then one inch down so i'm going to cut the shoulder slope out now and then for my neck i'll be taking three inches for the back and about five and a half for the front And now for my dart, that is nipple to nipple measurement, remember. Or you can just easily measure out your bust and divide into two and take off half an inch, which gives me four and a half inches. So you mark it up and down and then trace it and simply connect it to the middle of your arm hole. But I'm going to raise it a little high. don't forget that we left an allowance of where we're going to be printing on so you remember to mark it and notch it and also notch the middle so you remember where to print on so next we take our fabric and then cut our lining and then on the front we want to take off half an inch from our that so that when we finish sewing the print says that it will have very well So the first thing we want to sew in this project, when we want to start, we we'll start with the princess that for both the front and the back, we join them and we also join that of the lining before we can turn the neck of the dress. So after fixing my darts for the front, I'm going to be showing you how I did my neck printing. I did just two bold prints. You can as well do as many prints as you want, but I just did two prints. So you can use a pin to hold the print, then you sew on it before you turn the neck. It's better that way so the print wouldn't go off. You will also do the same thing to your lining before you finally turn the neck. So the work is almost completed. We've turned the neck and then we just have to attach our sleeve and then attach our flare and then the dress is ready. Thank you so much for watching this video this is the finished look you can as well add many prints on your neck if you want to please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so thank you so much and see you on the next video